Welcome, everybody, to the highest wrestling program in the entire world. Welcome, everybody, to NXT. We've seen this superstar take advantage of every opportunity to prove himself. Hey, Michael, there aren't many superstars who would take on the champ without the title on the line, but he sees the bigger picture and what it means for him. I expect after this match, his name will be on the lips of every higher up in WWE. And he'll be taking on the superhero known as Axiom. For what he lacks in size, he more than makes up for it in Braves. He's a nerd, Saxton. That's why you like him. You two probably sat at the same table during lunch. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh. Oh. He gets out of the way. Getting back into the ring. Just letting his opponent know who the real top guy is. Dominating shoulder tackle. He's got the shoulders down. And he gets the shoulder up. The ref barely started the count. Dominating shoulder tackle. Oh, this match grinded him down a little. He planned for this and can still rally. All over the face. Axiom at the mercy of his opponent. Axiom now just trying to survive. No, no. I'm not break his arm. Vicious. And he's able to reverse. Oh, what a DDT. Axiom reverses. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Oh, saw it coming and swept the leg. Corey, we know that Axiom has a deep bag of aerial skills that can upset the biggest opponents. How does that impact this match tonight? While his agility is impressive, Cole, Axiom does have a few weaknesses. With his calculating mind, we've seen Axiom overthink during a match, and it's cost him. But what his opponent needs to concentrate on is grounding him. That takes away a much bigger portion of Axiom's offense. Look at these vicious stomps in the corner. Attack after attack on target. Putting the boots to an opponent will take the fight out of them in a hurry. He's absorbing some tough hits now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some... Watch out. Diving shoulder tackle. Here's the cover. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. He clearly has no intention of staying down. Wow, what a pop kick. He could pin his opponent right his shoulder up before the two count. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Oh. Fends off the attack with an elbow. The adrenaline is pumping and the WWE Universe is on his side. Fall away moonsault, wow! Looking to apply an agonizing armbar stretch. Oh, that was not just painful on the shoulder. That pain can shoot all the way up to the neck and all the way down the arm. This is a smart strategy. And Axiom got turned around there. Big back body draw. Oh, you see the height on that? Just all take a moment to truly appreciate and embrace his presence. The fight could get very dangerous out of range. Flying. Avoiding oh. contact. Whoa. Adding a little flair to a damage and impact. Quite the showmanship. As their opponent down, rocking it in. This is agonizing. Well, this isn't going to win the fall, but it's going to do a lot of damage. Whoa, whoa, look at that. And somehow he's able to work his way out of the hold. Hooked up. Driven down. 
We are undoubtedly nearing the end. And this is, uh, well, it's not looking good. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. And he's taking this to the outside now. We're about to rearrange some furniture. Oh, slam. We gotta get some help out here. It's too late for help, Saxton. There's only mayhem and destruction from here on out. He returns to the ring. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Antagonizing your opponent instead of attacking him. Position, but steady punches provide an escape plan. Axiom finds the golden ratio. Axiom might have him. Cover! Whoa! That's, that's impossible. I, I can't believe what we just saw. And now the question runs in the mind, how am I going to be able to end this? Drop in the elbow right on the knee. To the gut will stop anyone in their tracks. Fighting back by the counter. As their opponent throws oh, a fixed bomb. And that can vanquish Axiom. Boom! We have seen such a physical match from these combatants, and the wear and tear is starting to show. And now's the time where the smartest competitor needs to take advantage of the situation. He needs to figure out the quickest way to end this. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Is there anything this superstar will not do? Apparently not, because this is going to be nasty. Power slam! He's thinking something else here. He's clearly not thinking about winning. Axiom sensed that was coming. He eludes the contact. Hooked up. Driven down. Let him have this moment. He's earned it. Exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. All eyes focused on this absolute war. It doesn't get more masterful than this. As their opponent up for a devastating crucifix bomb. Driven into the barricade. Axiom at the mercy of his opponent. And as he's grounding Axiom here, he's taking away a big portion of the High Flyers' offense. Great strength being shown here. Uh-oh. 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 right. Heading back to the ring. He's reminding his competition that they'll only ever be second best. On the apron, through the air, and connects! <laughs> Crafty way to get out of harm there. Looks like he has the upper hand now. Axiom now just trying to survive. Reversal! Can he take advantage? Can't quite get him there. And they're going shot for shot, no for mine. Boom! Back and forth, neither one giving up any ground. Oh. You can feel the contact, and so does the WWE Universe. Toe to toe, treating each other like heavy bags. They are emptying their tanks, going back and forth like this. Oh, 
In position and now muscling up their opponent. Three. Devastating crucifix bar. Two count. Oh, kicks out, kicks out. Within inches of victory, only to have it snatched away. This match just keeps getting more and more exciting. That was the best weapon in the arsenal, but it wasn't enough to produce an end result. This place is going insane. The ground beneath my feet is shaking. As their opponent down, walking it in. This is agonizing. What a unique submission maneuver here. And look at the pain his opponent's in. How much punishment can... Oh, my. And the resiliency to win this one. And here's another glance at these superstars in action. Here is your winner, Axiom. Axiom picks up the win. Make no mistake about it, this is a big win for Axiom. Everyone stand up and take notice. The master of motion is your winner. In the NXT North American title stole the show in its inaugural ladder match and has only become even more coveted in the years since its introduction. Well, it's easy to see why, Michael. NXT has some of the fiercest competitors in the world, and hey, the title looks pretty cool, too. This is a flat-out vicious attack. Blows to the back of the neck, and then... Getting him into the corner. He's got him scouted. Challenger. This isn't even close to over. Bam! D'Angelo showing no fear, no intimidation. Fisherman's Buster! And into the count. Then he gets the shoulder up before two. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. <laughs> Trying to put the champ out of sort, maybe even discombobulate them. Tony D'Angelo has to be a competitor prepared for a personality aside. He's proven to be quite the Mac technician and brawler. But for what he possesses in in-ring IQ and strength, Tony D does lack some in-ring experience. There's still a lot D'Angelo needs to unlock if he really wants to start climbing the WWE lap. Caught in a bad position here. Oh, jeez, falling hard to the outside. There's actually no regard for your opponent's safety when you toss them to the outside like that. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by countout. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, my gosh! Uh-oh, clearing off the announce table! Oh, this is a guy about to go from bad to worse. This is not going to be pretty! I don't want to see this happen. Taking this fight in a dangerous direction. Side and back to the mat. Oh, what a close line. And Tony is really dialed in right now. You can't expect any sympathy from D'Angelo here. Down with a power bomb. The champ has to be seeing stars after that vicious power bomb. Close line. So effective. his plan here. One. Savage stop right to the arm. Two. Three. Boom. What a counter by Tony. Oh, look out. Oh, misses the mark. 
Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Able to reverse that one. Arm ringer. Bang! What a punch. Up and protoplex. Now that is why they're the champ. There's two. He, no way. No way. This puts the pressure back on the champion. Can the champion respond with the back against the wall? And you can sense the desperation mounting as that last move couldn't finish things. Uh, right across the top rope. Right? Big boy. Short jab to the rib cage. Those are agonizing. Placed it over into a suplex. He's heading to the floor, but he can't take his time. Close line with their head. Boom, oh, piercing the sternum. Uh-oh. He had it scouted. Oh. <laughs> and Tony didn't see that coming. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Champ looking out of sorts. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. He knows how to avoid contact. Turning in the stomach to reverse that maneuver. for this superstar, or should I say, for the new champion. He dug deep into his offensive arsenal and played defense at the right time. And now, the title is his. That's the bell, and this match is underway. Despite the title not being on the line, you have to imagine that there will be major championship implications should the challenger, he's going for the pin. Kicks out in the nick of time. I'm surprised he wasn't able to kick out sooner. And a kick. Ooh. Oh, costly error there. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Big forearm. Frazier gets met with a response. And we know Nathan Frazier is all heart, but not exactly the biggest competitor. Corey, you think his size is going to play a factor in this one? Potentially put an even bigger target on him? Well, it's not like we haven't seen smaller superstars scale the peaks of WWE cold, but a smart opponent can all... Take off! Five-star frog splat! Is it enough? Two! A kick out before three. That was a long two count there fails to connect on the springboard no way oh no crashing hard onto the floor a huge miss there's bad timing and then there's whatever you want to call that there's the Canadian destroyer wow that was a jaw dropping move by Nathan Frazier for the power slam countered into an inverted DDT. Look at that. He's lost some of his win now. Frazier looking real motivated in that exchange. And we're down to the proverbial wire here, guys. The match hanging in the balance. Time to get back in the ring. Check out the springboard. Oh, oh man. And an impactful display of cover. 
Raises the shoulder before the one count. It is going to take a lot more to keep him down. Twists the arm and a... Oh, working on the arm. Arm ring. Oh, and a kick. That was nasty. Step up in, Zagiri. Oh. Forearm after forearm. Vicious attack. Nathan is undergoing a thrashing. And he's playing this very smart. Cutting Frazier down even more to size. Put into the corner now. This won't end well. What are we going to see here? Oh, no, no way. The top rope. Are you Falcon Arrow. Almost put him through the ring. When all else fails, sometimes you just have to go the high risk and hopefully high reward route. And shoulders are down. Still has enough energy for the simple kick out. That's a forearm that'll floor you. Snapmare takedown. Oh, a roundhouse kick. And he is now in a discouraging spot. Nathan keeps getting cut down. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Batting down the hatches. These two are unloading. It looks like we've got ourselves a brawl here. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. Exhaustion setting in, and neither one of them is letting up. Boom! Oh, man. Two fighters putting their haymakers on autopilot right now. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. Ooh. Ooh, stinging kick. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Debilitating attack on the leg. Just a blitz of offense on Frazier here. Yeah, the defects in his game are leaving him vulnerable. Here we go. Connected with the moonsault. Can that finish Nathan? He put him away. He picks up the win. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. Here is your winner, Jake Bob Evans. And Nathan Frazier will just have to accept this loss. Not every high risk leads to a high reward, and Nathan Frazier is living proof with this loss.